been going to Russia since I was a school child and, uh, and I was very lucky to have had the opportunity to learn Russian at school. Therefore it means a lot to me and the, uh, and the, the whole, the, the changes that this country has undergone, uh, to have witnessed that has, been, has really been one of the defining experiences of my life I suppose. In Russia on this uh, Golden Ring tour that we currently do, uh, we do see some very important uh, works in particular in the, in the area of wall paintings. So we can see that the vast majority of the churches that we go into, and the churches really are the main sites on this Golden Ring tour, the vast majority of these churches um, are, are painted. Uh, so they have frescoes inside and are so Russian is that well, one of the things that I actually try to do on the tour is to teach people how to look at a Russian church so that hopefully by the end of the tour people know that they are actually all different and that they, um, they all evol evolved over time and, uh, and so on. So the panoramic views of these vast monastery complexes, thinking of Sergei Passat, which is perhaps the, Russia's most revered and most, most important monastery just north of Moscow, but wherever you go, um, it always seems to be out of some kind of picture book. Just looking at incredibly beautiful sort of ensembles of architecture, but also then in terms of really getting your eyes stuck into something that is quite a, an alien uh, architectural tradition.